you have to just be you. And you're, it's a really great way to weed out the people who are not up to speed with where you're at, spiritually speaking, because if you share it and they can't receive it, think of you're on two different radio stations. You're listening to country and they like rock and you're just not speaking the same language and that's okay. There's no judgment, but you'll be able to then attract, kind of like acknowledge it, but then attract more people who love country music like you and be on the same wavelength. Look guys, I was 1997. I came out of the closet saying I talked to dead people and this was not in at all. So I had to shrink down and I had to deny and not share. And that wasn't being true to me. It was dimming my light. And then I said one day, you know what? I'm just going to own this. And the people who are at my same level will be drawn and the ones who aren't will fall out. And that's exactly what happened. So be you. Don't be afraid to let go of the ones who are judgmental or critical. The other thing is, if you know you get a gut feeling, this person isn't ready to hear or have this conversation, don't share because you end up going into defensive mode and that's going to bring your vibe down. So if you can be neutral and it doesn't trigger you, then by all means share. But if you know you're not, you're vulnerable and you're not there yet, just honor that boundary.